Wow, Mungo, come colleague, accident teacher, panda, we do the morning trolling. But now we are heading to the What's Trending, though, which is headed by Afa. No, okay. Amy. Okay. Afa, what do you have for Thank us? Thank you, Aisha. <laughs> like, uh -huh. um, this topic is really heartbroken because it's like it's so sad that we're still living in a country where we are not safe as girls or as women mm -hmm. you know we uh we have a 60 years old god a man rape a young girl yeah. and what is most serious about this thing is that the father is saying that he has forgiven the man for raping his child i mean yes he's a minor the parents can um uh, make decision on his behalf, but shouldn't this be a case uh, for the state, Omar? Um, rape is a crime. Yes. And when it comes to crime, it does not have to be within me and you. It is the responsibility of the state to make sure that you have been prosecuted. And even if the state um, is to remove the case or to, to, to discharge the case, it is going to be solely based on the direct of the prosecution. So you do not have the right to say, well, I will prosecute him. But you do not equally have the right to say it, um, that we forgive you. Because it's no longer at your domain, it is because at the interest of the state. And that's why it is called a crime. Mm -hmm. And if you look at it, um, it is a very serious crime. Bearing in mind that um, we have the Sexual Offenses Act that clearly prescribe what is rape and give the penalties of rape. And rape, in the government, you can be locked up for more than 50 years. It should be for life. Yeah, it was for life, but there's an amendment to that. But oh my um, I think the reason for the amendment is. Perhaps our prison system is not serving the purpose in which prison is meant for. Because the intention of having a prison is for, to make sure that there is rehabilitation. rehabilitation. And if there is no rehabilitation center in our prison system, we cannot afford, afford to lose most of our youngsters in mm -hmm. the prison. Uh, at the end, they can be pardoned. And if they are pardoned when they have spent a lot of years in prison, they might end up committing the same crime. So what they are advocating for is to make sure that our prison system is intact. But to encourage people um, to avert themselves from committing uh, the offense of rape. They never know here. Gambia, man, they read rape case you bari. Halle, man, more than your rape. Young high boy. Come on. My problem is why do parents feel that they should protect the rapist and who raped their children? Or why do you think that uh, because he's a friend of the family or? You know, we don't we don't have to expose him because we tarnish the family image. You know, things like that. We really should consider it. It's not just a problem for Gambians, but African at large. Which is why we have more perpetrators and we have more victims. Like no wanting to no wanting to say their mm -hmm. stories because they act they are afraid of public shaming. People mm -hmm. coming and coming to them Condemn and telling them it's their fault because you wear this, because you go there, because you were like this, you were drunk. We should first of all know that rape can never be the victim fault. It can only be the fault of the perpetrator. Because rape is in the mindset. You plan it. You don't just go and jump on it. You plan to rape the person. That's why you rape them. It's not a mistake. It's, it, it is unforgivable. And the fact that we say, okay, you shouldn't dress like this, like you at home. You to ask your doctor not to dress like that because somebody is coming. Then that person shouldn't come at your house at the first place. Yes, of course. Women can wear what they want to wear. The problem is the rapist. You shouldn't rape people. You should know consent. We should learn to teach our boys about consent. Consent can be withdrawn at yes, any me time. No, no, me no. Yes, of course. Consent and silence means no. Consent can be withdrawn at any time. But silence can and the people, the funny thing is, mm. we are not raped by psychopaths. We are not raped by strangers. We are raped by the family people. Like the brothers at home, the uncles, the cousins, Friends. the imams, the priests. And you know what? Do you know what they are doing? Perhaps they cannot control their temptations. Excuse me. Why is the story of the family? The family is the family. 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 It doesn't even have to be your dumb, Aisha. 
Perhaps he was doing the same thing. You know, <laughs> come on, let me tell you something. <laughs> Only rape, uh, whenever you see a rape apologist, know that he has once, or he's about, or he has the mentality that rape is normal. People have been normalizing rape yeah. here in the country. So any rape apologist, the, rape, the rapists or the rape apologists are equally the same. None is better than the other. Do you know what's more No, I'm there. Kill a woman in a barrel or kill a rape. I kill a rape. No, I'm but what do you have to say about yeah, this? Yeah, I, I, I was uh, gonna say the <coughs> forgiveness from the parent. I think that can be based on personal grounds if they wish. Like, okay. you're my friend, I forgive you, but that has nothing to do with the law. Mm -hmm. I mean, th th this is a civil matter. You've, you, you've violated a lady, a young girl, and the state has to intervene, and it has to be, a, be in the course. And if you found guilty, he should be jailed for it. Regardless of the forgiveness from the family, I think some of these things should not be compromised. Mm -hmm. Rape is rape. It's a crime. It's a crime. So there should be no negotiation in it. Mm -hmm. And you and know I what, guys? I mean, the girl is pregnant, oh. mm -hmm. which is very, very, very serious. Because how can you carry a child that you get out of being raped? You're always like giving back to that child. You're always being reminded that yes, I was raped and I have you. Yeah, this thing may continue forever. Just, just rape is is enough trauma. Like you, the rapist, you have like two seconds of enjoyment or three seconds, and the, the victim is going to live a lifetime of trauma, a lifetime of rape scene repeating in her. It's not even because you are forcing the girl to do oh, it. whatever it is, but. You are giving problem to the rapist, but people don't give attention to the rape, uh, victim. Mm -hmm. They rather shame you. They rather said you are nyaka jom, or you have to suture yourself. Suture yourself for what? You've been raped. You have the right to speak up mm -hmm. for justice to be served. And we have associations. But this is why we have more rape victims, like sitting in the corner mm -hmm. and you know suffering in silence, mm -hmm. because people don't really believe you. We, first of all, we need to make our children, our ladies, our girls, mm. our sisters, our friends. I mean, men, we don't need you to fight for us when it comes to rape. We just need you to leave us alone, don't rape us. We just need you to be Alice. And to do that, you must not rape. You must understand consent that it can be withdrawn at any time. That keeping quiet doesn't mean, yes, I agree. Mm -hmm. No means no. But let, come on, some people don't let you know that. <laughs> it must be concerned and we should make also make this clear. So I'm okay eighteen years. Moon should you have consent. A child under eighteen years cannot give consent. Mm -hmm. No matter how big she is, no matter how tall she is, no matter how plumpy she is, no matter how the body is, she cannot give consent. She's underage. Mm -hmm. But people don't know that. Fear are Aisha. No, I'm not I'll, I'll tell you. <laughs> most of these young girls are 16 are dating pedophiles. Are dating predators. Those people should be arrested. At 16, young did did I'm 28 years. More than I'm the mother. But we are we are putting less attention to that. And it's very wrong. Um, Afa, thank you for bringing that point. I just want to remind you, um, yeah. I think the Gambia Women's Lawyer Association, FLAC, mm -hmm. they played a very g great role when it comes to the Sexual Offenses Act. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because it's before, we have what they call defilement and rape. Mm -hmm. Bef befi defilement before the, below the age of 18. Okay. Perhaps that time, um, you can commit the offense of rape. But now everything is rape. Um, a girl before the age of 18 cannot give consent. Of as course. Mm -hmm. out. Mm -hmm. But equally, um, even if you are above the age of 18, mm -hmm. no is no. No is no. And consent, and now rape is very critical. If you look at rape now. Maybe now we should make it clear you can rape your girlfriend, you can rape your wife. Yeah, and now what, the, the, what is more critical about rape is slightly penetration or insertion or, in, in, uh, or any form of misrepresentation. Mm -hmm. You know, perhaps you can, you can uh, behave just like your husband. But even though she gives consent, but she believes on the fact that perhaps it is his husband. That is a, is a rape now. Now, I'm very similar to your husband. I found you sleeping and I just, you know, try to have issues with you. 
Unfortunately, you realize that it is not your husband, it is rape. In Sasson, just to take a pen or any other thing, to put your finger in someone's, you know, private part, is also rape. To have carnal knowledge of her sexually through the penetration is also rape. And whether you have the rape occurred itself or you have attempted rape, to be convicted of rape is very easy. Um, because the evidence, uh, uh, to, to be convicted of rape, all what we need is one, penetration and consent. There should not be any consent. There should also be a little slight penetration alone, just touching, least touching of the, 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 the genital part of the female is, is accepted as rape. And perhaps other uh, report from the police station, some, sorry, from the hospital, they will need evidence uh, to show that there is definitely penetration. And yes, but it's we easy know to that. Convict a person. Yeah, and yes, we know that boys do are being raped. Yeah. But then, if you see, we are uh, putting the focus or putting more attention to the ladies or girls or women, it's because we are more oppressed, mm -hmm. because we are more into vulnerable places. Like you are not comfortable walking alone at night. Because you are afraid that somebody might just come and rape you. Of course. Yeah, yeah, I do. I do good is at the wire because you're rushing, young is at a shadow bit. Because you have the mindset that people somebody might just come here and rape you. Yes. And the offices. The offices, the institution. You know, we're taking you're taking advantage of girls. Especially young girls, younger girls. But because how many coco no hate now. Ah, how many come like? Papa, you know, you know, they rape. Then they, Papa, they lari. Papa, they have come like your rape issue is not relevant. Like somebody raped you, and you told the person that this was rape, and she was like, "It was not rape. Nobody's gonna believe you because you came here and you are my girlfriend." Please speak up. We're gonna believe you. Maybe everybody's not gonna believe you, but there will be few genuine people that will be on your side. Yes, if you say your story, we will believe you. Uh, Papa, you are very right. But then one thing. People have to be very careful when it comes to rape. Yes. Because the tan to turn someone's image in rape is very, very easy, especially in the society that we are in. Mm -hmm. I read a case in Brikama uh, where a person was alleged to have committed the offense of rape. But unfortunately, the lady, it was just a plan between him and her mom. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, there was a shopkeeper in their compound, but the shopkeeper, he did not even greet them because he stayed in that compound. But just slam alaikum, you know, sometimes if you want anything from the shopkeeper, mm -hmm. he, will, he will not allow you to Perhaps that your father but will be no, one no, step. I'm just trying to, we, we are educating. Yeah, we are educating. Not, ladies should not use rape as a way of, you know, substituting, you know, men. Or as a way and of, one, one, one thing for it's, the police. It's, it's crazy. Some of these cases are not true. Mm -hmm. Do you know that? Most, majority of the cases of rape, you can report 100 cases and almost only 45% of them will be proven. No, be I don't believe that. No, it, it happens. Look at, look at, go to the law report. There are many people that were accused of the offense of rape. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, the court found out that he was just allowed to have committed the offense of rape, but it was not true. Now you have to miss that person's image. People mm -hmm. should be careful. Before you allow the offense of rape, the stigma attached to it, you know the societal reaction towards the person who is allowed to have committed the offense of rape is too high. Before you accuse a person, yes. have very credible evidence. Mm -hmm. And this is why it's the ones you have been raped, just report it. Mm -hmm. Than to wait three months, four months, Excuse after one year. Excuse me, Omar. Hmm? No, if you are if you are raped, it's better you report it earlier. Earlier, yeah. No, then, yeah. The person can report when he or she is comfortable to do so. No, but, but yes. we are here to advise. No, the reason no. of reporting it is, is to make sure that you have I enough evidence. Report. Excuse me, I can only report about my rape case when in my in my own convenient time. Mm -hmm. You cannot force me because but I have been through something that I have to sit down and you know go to it and rethink it okay. i'm being traumatized so you don't have to expect no. me or you don't have to tell me that i should report immediately no Afa, we are here to educate people and we're going to give them the best of their solution okay. the problem of rape right now in case even the state council to, 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 to prove a case a rape of case mm -hmm. is because of time you know when there is a span of time mm -hmm. you find it very difficult to prove wow. because we need medical evidence mm -hmm. and perhaps someone has raped you it is you know we know how our medical system is to prove certain things are very difficult. Once you are raped, confess to your family members that someone's raped you. Be bold enough to say so. But if you wait, for instance, two or one year or at least three months, if you want do to you prove it. you know the kind of families we have at home? We know, but we are advising people. Let them do the best thing. Well, and do you think that rape and parents is that yes? do you think rape is not always violent? But no, it's not always violent. But normally what happens is um, perhaps it is going to be an arrangement. Oh, yeah, it is going to be an arrangement. Rape you is not always violent. You invite someone into your compound, unknowingly, perhaps 
you 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 know try to well, but, 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 but for me you, 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 don't, need, you don't always need a medical you, proof thank you, thank you Afa. no you don't need you can com- continue this to your jollof girl show yes please join us on a jollof girl show and we can talk more about this mo ngok xam nga accident ci chapanda ba di jégalu so xam be su fekké né wax nañ fé lu ñaaw di jégalu bu baaxa baaxa ba su ci waxé lu rafet lañ pour yeen la nak di lay joxa de jojé rek mais ben edition of the good morning show bye bye wa jërëngeen viewers mu lay faté dem ci youtube bi dégg dégg muy lolu